Short But Bitter. I'm Ruben. And I'm Jasmine. And today we're here drinking El Soli by 21st Amendment Brewery. Cheers. Cheers. What are your thoughts? I think it's okay. <clears throat> it's yeah. not the, the greatest thing I've ever tasted, but it's not the worst. Like, I taste a hint of something, but I can't put my finger on it. But other than that, it's just like, it just seems like a really watered down beer to me. And, well, I, I think that's what they were going for somewhat, but <clears throat> it definitely has a, I, I don't know if they meant to have that skunkiness, but there is a Probably. little skunkiness and I definitely Probably. get that from, they're trying from to most make Mexican beers. So. Mexican style, yeah, they all kind of have that, that taste in there. I mean, it's definitely a step above Corona, like I'd drink this any day over that shit. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I think anybody would drink this over Corona. It definitely has a cool can. Yeah. I mean, if it's there, I'll drink it. You know, it's not. It's definitely not oh. bad. It's it's definitely drinkable. There's a cool quote on the back. Um, I'll let Jasmine read that. Okay. <laughs> All right, it says, You are closer to him right now than most people will ever have the good fortune to be. How would you rate this? Would you give it a thumbs up? Mm -hmm. I think I'd give it like a half. Mm -hmm. Right in the middle. I don't know. It's not. It's not. It doesn't do anything for me. This one's actually gonna have to be a thumbs down for me. Like, I, honestly, I I like everything they put out. Like, Twenty First Amendment puts out, but. But is this a disappointment? It's not. It's not that bad. Like, I drink it if it's there, but I definitely wouldn't. I wouldn't buy it again. You know, so. Yeah. So I would have to give it a thumbs down. If I wouldn't buy something again, I would give it a thumbs yeah. down. Yeah. So there it is. Try it if you want to, but you're not missing out on anything. <laughs> 